Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today I have a very exciting meeting. Um, of course, a like video chat meeting, but it's still very important to me. So I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me because I was instructed to get um like makeup on, get all nice, put on a nice dress, whatever. So I am going to be showing you my process for getting ready, and it is an audition. So it'll basically be like my at home get ready with me for an audition for the first time in two months, so that is quite a video. Um, so I am going to um, straighten my hair, I think, and then do my hair and do my makeup and then get into my dress, so I'm just gonna show you guys all that. I'm gonna start off with just pulling my hair back and um, washing my face, and then after that, I guess I'll put makeup on, so I'm gonna just comb my hair. I just use this Neutrogena Ultra Gentle Daily Cleanser, the foaming one, so. I'll do that and then I will be right back. All right, I washed my face. Now I'm going to comb out my eyebrows and then I'll start working on some concealer. So I just wanna make sure my eyebrows like dry in the right position and then I will do concealer. I'm not gonna put on any foundation cause I don't wanna look too, too made up but I do wanna cover up like a few spots that I have and everything. So I'm gonna do this and then I will be back with concealer. I'm trying to pick which concealer shade I should use today. Um, I think I'm going to go with the Ulta Beauty Full Coverage Liquid Concealer, I think. I don't know. It doesn't really matter that much, but hopefully this one looks good enough. Um, so I'm going to put on some concealer, and I'll blend it out. I'm just going to do a little bit under my eyes, and then a little bit on a few spots I have. Nothing much. And then I will blend it out with my beauty blender. Alright, I think that looks good enough just to cover up like the little dark patches under my eyes. Now I guess I'll just do some mascara and then, well I guess I'll now put on petroleum jelly. I always put that on my lips just like as gloss but also as um, moisturizer. and. I might put on lip gloss later, but this is just a good base to put on before that. I also use it as like moisturizer around my nose if I need it, but I'm not going to put that on right now. So yeah, I guess I'm just going to make sure all my concealer looks good, and then I will move on to mascara. So for mascara, I'm using like the brown toned um, CoverGirl Clump Crusher. That's my favorite of the more affordable mascaras. Um, I'm not a beauty guru, so I just have random ones that you can get at like Walmart and Target, but this is my favorite for just pretty cheap. So I'm gonna put this on and then I think I'm gonna go do my hair. Of course I go stab myself in the eye, but I will be back once I'm done with this because this is quite an intensive job. All right, here's what the um, mascara looks like. So this video could also be seen as like my minimal makeup routine because I really don't do anything. I just do like concealer and mascara just for like a normal school day or really anything I'm going to, to be honest. Um, some days I might add like more lip gloss or something like that, but it doesn't really change that much. So I'm going to take my hair down. I'm just waiting for the straightening iron to heat up so I can straighten my hair and then I have this like pullback kind of side thing like a Dutch braid or French braid just like pull back and then it'll be braided down so hopefully that works out but that's what I want to do um we will see how it turns out but first I gotta straighten my hair pretty straight probably as straight as it's going to be so I uh, am going to do the braid I might get dressed first though actually no I'm just gonna do the braid so I was thinking about it I think I'm going to just part it like back to here and then do a Dutch braid or something like that and braid it down so yeah I'm gonna do that now
Here's what my hair looks like. I think the braid turned out pretty well. It looks nice because this side of my hair was kind of falling onto my face. So I think that looks pretty good. Um, now I'm going to go get dressed and then I'll have to start getting my room ready because I have to put up lights and stuff and get the computer all ready because it is a Skype call. So yeah, let's go get my dress on. I'd like to show you it first and then I will put it on. So um, I would have probably worn something different if they didn't have a few restrictions on what we wear. So they wanted us to not wear stripes. So sadly, like at least half of my closet is stripes. So I did have to pick something else. But I do have this black wrap dress that I got from Target like a year or two ago. It's just, you can't really see it that well with the low contrast, but... Um, you will see it when it's on me. Um, also, I have this little beaded necklace. It's got like pink and green beads on it. I'm just going to wear that. It's pretty simple, but I think it'll look nice. So yeah, I'm going to put this on and then I will see you guys in a second. Here's what my outfit looks like. Um, you can't really see the bottom of the dress, but it's just pretty short and flowy. So I'm pretty nervous for this, to be honest, but um, I have one hour to get my room ready, so I'll show you guys that. But first, I need to get some lunch because I'm very hungry. So I will be right back, but then let's put up the lights. Guys, I just got done with my audition. I'm shaking so bad. I was I'm so scared, but like I think it went well. Like my mind tells me it went well. My body tells me that I just like flubbered a lot of the time and whatever, but I know they'll just edit that out. I'm still pretty nervous though. Um I think the lady really did like me though because at the end she told me if this doesn't work out, she wants to send me some more opportunities. So I think that is really awesome. Um, yeah, so you can see my lighting that I set up here. I will show you it in a second, but I just need to get this off my chest because, oh, I, I'm very excited for this, honestly. So after this, um, she's going to send it off to the whole company and they're going to edit it together and put my pictures and videos and then see if they want to pick me. If they don't, I am not totally devastated because I will have more opportunities. So I think that is super awesome. And I am shaking, and I could not stop yawning before it, and it was really bad. But I think I did okay. If you're, like, into acting or anything, you really know how it feels before you go into an audition. And even in the audition, you kind of just, like, mess up, and they kind of just have to judge you on your mess up. So, I mean, it is what it is, really. But let me show you my setup. So we have lights everywhere. Um, we've got all of these lights here, and then that light, and then that light, and oh my gosh, exposure, and then that light. Um, and they just wanted to see my room to see that they could um, get to know me a bit more just by the stuff that I have all over my room. So yeah, whew. I think that is a wrap to this video. I can't wait to get the makeup off and get into some comfy clothes because it's super hot out and I think I'm going to go swimming. So that would be fun. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed just seeing me get ready and then seeing me be very nervous and then seeing how I messed up but kind of didn't mess up. I really don't know how it went to be honest. But yeah, I guess I will see you guys later. Bye!